Hi, this video is brought to you by TechDirectArchive.com. In this video, I'll be showing you how to run Windows Memory Diagnostics tool in Windows. There are some times that um, you may di discover that um, you are having memory issues on your system, and what you just need to do is to try and see if you can um diagnose what the actual problem is and the best tool you can use is the windows memory diagnostics tool in windows um let me just show you how to bring up this uh, tool for you to be able to use it and test your memory your system memory so um let me log into my system now So once I'm logging, I will go to the. Let me go to let it complete the login process. Okay, fine. We are inside now. So we just go to the search, search for memory. Once you search for, you see, um, you see Windows Memory Diagnostic. Just click on it. So once that comes up, you see two options. Restart now and check for problems recommended. Check for problems the next time I start my computer. We're going to choose the first option. Just click on it. Once you click on it, your system will restart immediately. So you can see the checks currently going on. This is the auto check. It's checking your memory in case you have any problem with it and uh, once you discover any issue it's going to um, display the actual issue in the memory so it's going to the auto check is uh, one of the, um, two running tests i mean so it's going to run the test twice and uh, as i said earlier on is this is the auto check for any issue in your memory so but we also have uh, the advanced one if you want to go into the advanced check you click on the f1 uh, key if you click on the f1 key you are going to see text mix you see text means you see um three types of the text mix. we have the basic we have the standard we have the extended so if you just scroll up and down the description will be showed to you so um, for instance this one basic text the description is um, the basic text that METS plus IMVC and others so same with standard standard test will include all the basic tests the standard will have all the tests uh together so once um any of the three that you decide to use you can just select it then you can click the tab button so once you click the tab button you just to just be going down and um, you can select um you can type by I me mean, the pass count that you want so the default was two so i'm going to put four let me add four so we have four there now so once that is done um you just need to click on the f10 button to apply the setting and it will start checking for you to start testing your memory so now let me click on the f10 So it started, you can see it's now running two or four. So we actually change it from the um, default to now we have it's going to run the test four times. So this is um, a way to check any memory issues on your system. It is a very good diagnostic tool from windows 
So you can equally skip the test. You can equally skip it and you'll be able to log into your system. So the test will actually run, each of those tests will run to 100%. So that is uh, that about how to run Windows Memory Diagnostics tool in Windows. So, so you can try and make use of this tool whenever you discover that there's a memory issue on your system or perhaps maybe your system is behaving somehow. Just use this tool to diagnose what the issue is. So I hope you enjoyed uh, this video. Thank you for watching.